Hey, today we're going to talk about Native Americans as depicted in European art. It would appear to me from the engraving, They're Sitting at Meat by Debray, that Europeans tended to whitewash Native Americans. Their facial features, hairstyle, and musculature are all altered to be in line with European ideals. In the original watercolor, Indian Man and Woman Eating by John White, the Native Americans appear less toned and less anglicized. Debray might have been trying to make the art more accessible or sympathetic to the European audience. I have seen other European art depicting foreign lands, both real and imaginary, and then depicting the people there as Caucasian when there are no other prominent physical descriptors, which probably also stems from a tendency towards the familiar. The watercolor shows the Native Americans dressed up in accessories and revealing clothing. But the engraving changes this, taking away most of the feathers on the man's body and putting him in a much more modest cloth. The woman's clothing is changed too. Uh, her breasts are covered and her necklace and hair are beautified. The man's hair is also modified. Uh, the hair uh, was in an unkempt mohawk in the watercolor but then it's more of a band or a crest in the engraving. And there's still hair on the sides of his head when there was none in the uh, watercolor. This change was probably made over religious differences and cultural attitudes towards vanity. The way that the Native Americans sit also changes between watercolor and engraving. In the watercolor, they sit with their legs close to the body, but in the engraving, their legs are stretched out. Perhaps Debray thought that the Native Americans would look more comfortable in a different sitting position, and that his audience would think so too. Overall, there seems to be a general push towards making the Native Americans appear civilized so as not to offend European sensibilities. Thank you.